Hi, my name, my name is Sharp Game, and I'm back with another video. And today, I'm a, I'm a I got a question from one of my uh, viewers a couple days ago, and he sent me an email and asked me, "How do you deal with competition when it comes to women?" And this is something I had that I actually struggled with when I was young, my early teens and early twenties. And it's something that I never really heard anybody really talk about in great details. How do you deal with competition with women when you know, especially when she when she has other guys around or when other guys are probably trying to step to a, a girl that you probably want to talk to and after years of uh, struggling dealing with this this is how I really see it to this day this is really this is really how it is it's not but this is how I deal with it now first off you gotta understand that nobody's like you you're you're a very unique individual. No one can beat you at being you. So with that being said, if you're trying to be like somebody else besides yourself, you've already lost. I'm going to say that again. If you're trying to be someone else besides yourself, you've already lost and you might be asking well why do I say that because that's what most guys are doing that's what most women are doing they're trying to be somebody else besides themselves and what's what happens is you got a bunch of everyone's following the herd everyone's trying to fit in everyone's trying to be down everyone's trying to be like everybody else so you can't stand out in the crowd. So you've already lost if you're trying to be like someone else or if you're trying to compete with someone else. The best thing you can do is be yourself and go out of your way to do the opposite or be different. Or like for example, if some every if everybody's if everybody's going right, go left. If everyone's buying a house, don't buy. If everyone's getting a certain type of car that you know personally, don't get the car. If everybody's wearing a certain type of clothes, don't buy the clothes. If everyone's buying a certain type of shoes that you might like, don't buy it. If everyone's listening to a certain type of music, don't listen to it. You got to do things counterintuitive. You got to go completely in reverse. And at the end of the day, you won't have to deal with any competition because you're going to stick out if you go about it in the way that I'm telling you right now. If you take my advice, it, it won't be any competition because there's no one like you. You're unique. Everyone has greatness inside them, which most people don't tap into because they're trying to fit in and they're trying to follow everybody else. And they want to be accepted by everyone else. And they think about that all the time. And they think that they have to go outside to find all the answers, to find out some secret that someone else has that they don't know about and they think that this is why in America they well all over the world now they like celebrities and worship celebrities so much because they think that somehow the celebrity or the entertainer knows something or got some magic pill that they don't have and the entertainer is trying to figure it out just like you are but a lot of people don't realize that because they put people on a pedestal and they somehow think that 
they got this big giant secret inside them that that they're hiding from everybody else and they want to find out what it is so they want to get close to this person or they want to get next to this person or they want to reach out and touch this person but the reality is there is no competition you might find people that's smarter than you intelligent than you that were raised better than you or, or raised worse than you or grew up worse than you but they're not better than you everyone's unique in their own little way people grew up different they're from different places they speak different languages sometimes uh, they might dress differently sometimes I mean it might have a different skin color different hair whatever so there is no competition the best thing you can do is be you whatever that is whatever that means to you and find the greatness that's inside you somewhere somehow tap into that 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 those emotions those desires those dreams those aspirations that's that's inside you lay dormant that you haven't even probably gotten started using yet so there is no competition when it comes to you attracting women and don't let women seduce you into believing that somehow you have to be a certain type of guy to get with her that's bullshit all you have to do is be more of who you already are and when the smoke clears the people that's looking for you are supposed to be with you will stick around and everybody else will kick rocks so that's what I think about that so if you like what you heard in this video um, subscribe to my channel and, and check out my blog at chooseyourrelationships.com that's chooseyourrelationships.com and I'll put the links in at the bottom of this video so until next time, my name is Mr. Sharp Game. Peace and love.